So this is Agora Pulse, and uh, it's a newer uh, social media dashboard uh, that allows you to manage uh, a bunch of your channels uh, across the board, both Twitter, Facebook, all kinds of different, whatever you've got, Instagram, you can manage all of those. So I'm just going to show you some of my favorite things about this particular social media dashboard. I've been using it now for a couple of months, and um, these are some of the things that I really like about it. So first of all, I'm just going to log in real quick. Um, it's connected to your Facebook account, so you'll notice that it'll ask you to log in through Facebook once you do. Once you've logged in, you can connect up over here. I don't have all of my social media channels connected here, but I do have a lot of them connected here you can connect up all your social media channels over here. Now, a couple of things that you can do while you're in here. You can check out anything that people have, messages that people have left for you on your page. So you don't actually have to go into Facebook and go to your actual page in order to check that. You can actually see everything here all in one place. So that's your, this is my, um, my Facebook page for my business. Here's my Instagram account. You can see all of the people who have left me messages on Instagram, uh, my LinkedIn, and finally the Twitter. So uh, what you're looking at right now is my publishing schedule for Twitter. And what I, one of the things that I wanna show you about Agora Pulse that I really like that it does is it allows you to publish one message multiple times. Now, I normally use Hootsuite, and when it comes to Hootsuite, let me just show you really quickly what I have to do if I want to share a message, uh, a tweet on Hootsuite multiple times. So here's my, this is my, um, my blog, and let's just scroll down a little bit and let me take you to my most recent blog post. So this is a blog post that I just published yesterday, uh, it's a travel vlog from when I was in Paris. It's called Travel Vlog Biking in Paris. Now, in order for me to share this link, all I do is I do a right click and then I click on share link with Hootlet. And what it does is it pulls up the, um, it pulls up the name of the blog post and also it gives it a URL. And then if I want to, I could put some hashtags in here just to, you know, spiffy it up a little bit. I can put in travel vlog Paris. Okay, you can change any of that that you want. Okay, now I have two choices from here. I can either hit, well, I, technically I have three choices. I can hit post now, which will share the post right now uh, on to my Twitter feed. I can hit post later and choose a date and a time for later to share it. So let's say I wanna share it September the 14th at 3.20 p.m. I can do that. The other option that I have for sharing this is their auto schedule feature. Now in uh, Hootsuite, what they allow you to do is they allow you to auto schedule up to nine posts per day. Basically all you do is you hit auto schedule, it throws it into the queue, it sends those tweets out at random times during the day, uh, and once you hit whatever your limit is, nine, you tell it how many you want it uh, to send out every day. Once you hit that limit, it just automatically sends your tweet to the queue for the next day. So I actually use this auto scheduling post or this auto scheduling feature quite a lot. It's, I find it pretty useful. So, however, if I send this out right now, so let's say I'm going to do it for later. Um, or even if I send it right now, or even if I auto schedule it, if I want to schedule this post to go out again, what I have to do is I have to copy the tweet. Um, and then what I would do is I would schedule or auto schedule the post, and then it would go into my queue. Then I have to go to Hootsuite and create a new message, paste that in. And then what I would have to do is schedule it again for another time. Now, Hootsuite also has this thing called a bulk uploader and what it allows you to do is it allows you to bulk upload messages. Great and I use it extensively however you cannot bulk upload two messages that are exactly the same. So that's challenging. So basically I can only send out one message at a time through Hootsuite and I, I find that a bit frustrating and a bit challenging. Agora Pulse, however, watch this. So I'm gonna hit publish on here, and what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna actually paste in that tweet that I just wrote uh, from my blog. So what it's gonna do is, so here's the link right here. It pulls up, um, it automatically loads a preview of what that's gonna look like when we look at it on Twitter. Now watch this, I have three options here. Again, I can publish it now, right at this moment, um, and that will send it to my Twitter feed immediately. 
I can add it to the queue. I'll show you what that looks like in a second, or I can schedule it. So I'm just gonna go with schedule right now and I'm gonna hit next. Now, what you'll see is once I hit the scheduling option, it gives me three more options. Schedule once, repeat content, or schedule again. So what I can do is I can hit repeat content and what it's going to do is I can set it to schedule this content to go out once a week, once a month, um, every 12 hours. It's really cool. So what I can do is I can adjust this and then I can say, I want you to send my, uh, I want you to send out this tweet, uh, every, let's say, uh, bit slow sorry uh, every 12 hours every nine or oh I guess it only goes up to nine so every nine hours and I want you to do that up to four times and then what it does is it ought see what it does it automatically sticks those in there for me isn't that cool really cool now if you don't like that option the other thing you can do is you can hit schedule again and what you can do is you can say, I want you to send this tweet. Hang on one sec, sorry. My computer's, there we go. I want you to send this at, uh, on 9-9-2007 uh, at 3.10 p.m., but then I can hit add another date or time. And now what I can do is it will now send it um, you know, on the 10th, or I can say send it on the 13th, but I want to send it at a different time of the day. This one I sent in the afternoon, so I want to send that one in the morning, so I can just change this to 9, 10 a.m., and it'll throw it in there. So this is really cool. I like this a lot. I like that it allows me to send tweets out multiple times. I don't normally do this except for if it's uh, content for my own site. I normally tweet stuff out multiple times if it's for my own site. Now, just to show you that again real quickly, um, they have this option called Add to Queue. And what I've done is I've created a schedule here in my Twitter that automatically sends out a tweet at one o'clock and at 8 p.m. every day because those are the high times on my personal Twitter feed where I get lots of people um, who are around. So I can just hit add to queue and it will automatically add that into my queue and it'll tweet that out at one o'clock and then at 8 p.m. the next day. It's really neat. So I like this a lot. It's a very, as you can see, I have tons of stuff scheduled up and ready to go here. I like this a lot. Um, when it comes to Twitter, you really want to have uh, evergreen content on there, and there's nothing wrong with scheduling up multiple tweets. Uh, I will usually do three or four tweets uh, at a time. I mean, not at a time, but I will usually do three or four tweets um, over a several days for each blog post that I write. Uh, so that's Agora Post, or Agora Pulse. Sorry, I just wanted to show you that. Um, and show you some of the cool stuff it can do. I may be back again as I continue to play with this program a little bit and do some more posts on this, uh, on this tool at some point in the future. Thanks.